Welcome to the IBM Podcast Network. Hi, this is Amit Doshi, and I wanted to thank each and every one of our listeners. It's been two years since I founded IBM, and it's been an amazing two years. We wanted to learn a little bit more about who is listening to our shows, and so we put together a short survey. The survey is anonymous, and we aren't going to be collecting any personal information. I would really appreciate it if you could take a couple of minutes out of your day and go to ivmpodcast.com slash survey and fill it out. Thanks, and please keep listening. You're listening to TFG Interviews. Hello guys, welcome to a brand new episode of TFG Interview Podcast. Uh, this is the kind of a podcast where we bring you all the eminent sporting personalities around the world, mostly from India. Uh, Siju is in Bangalore and she caught up with uh, JJ. So uh, this is an episode about it. Uh, now, uh, one thing that the interview was done on Monday, so... Uh, nothing about the AFC game uh, against Bengaluru FC, but he is speaking about you know uh, his ISL experience, his season so far with Bagan, and you know all the three coaches that he has played under have been instrumental. He says uh, mostly to Stephen Constantine, Sanjay Sen, and Materazzi. So uh, he also speaks about as well their run uh, for the trophy and a bit about national camp. So guys, let's move on to the interview itself. How is how would you describe the season so far? I think this season uh, we did uh, quite well. In, uh, like we ha- we played uh, 15 matches right now, and we lost one match, and uh, we drew four matches. I think we did quite well, but you know, as we said, I league. Uh, if you want to win the league, the trophy, and uh, we cannot lose one point also right now. And the FC we did well, and now we qualify for the group stage and. We need to do the this performance. Uh, we need to continue. and need to improve uh, the performance. Mm. Now, coming talking about your form, uh, last season you were the top goal scorer in throughout. You got the best, you know, uh, best striker, the best player of the award. Uh, so how does how is it like right now? Because the form is kind of you know haywire. You got your form back again in the AFC when you were playing. Then again, there was a dip. So does that? Put you under pressure after a great season, and now. No, it's not about. It's not like that. Uh, when uh, when you play ISL, I got injured on my calf, and you know I'm out of almost uh, one and a half month. And then when I joined Mohan Bagan, and uh, I don't, I'm not a full fit, fit hundred percent fit. And still right now I'm improving my fitness. And but last match I have problem with my knee, and that's why I, I don't I don't play in the starting. And but this match I hope I'll, I'll play in the eleven, and I hope I'll score goal and. We win that uh, Yeah, so do you think uh, there's like an inside competition right now? In yeah, Japan, it's. Uh, yeah, we have, uh, especially a striker, always last three years, uh, we have a big uh, competition in our striker, but it's a healthy competition, you know. Every day, every training, we need to fight and to get this, uh, this position. So it's good, it's good for the players, you know. Uh, we need to fight every day, every break, training. It's good for me. And uh, what about now, you are also in the national team uh, in the camp, and no. you'll soon starting and you'll already be joining after your AFC Cup match. Uh, so, how, how is that like? Uh, you know, even Robin Singh ha- has kind of found his form. So, do you see a competition over there? Yeah, well? of course. Uh, always, uh, I, I, I'm very happy, you know, every team I go, there is always competition. But, you know, I need to fight, like I said, I need to fight every day with training. So, I need to do the extra work and let's see what will happen. Okay. Uh, now, the other one, how was your ISL experience? How, how, how has it been so far with Yeah, it's quite well, but you know, last two years uh, we did so well in uh, qualify for the knockout stage, and, but this, this season we are we not qualified for the uh, knockout stage. But I think we did quite well. Like, uh, I still uh, five matches, I think we're considering the goal in the last uh, 10 minutes. I think if you're not considering that goal, then maybe you can qualify for the uh, group stage. No go stays, so, but uh, I think the team performance is not so good. But individual, it's I think I'm did okay. But you know, last uh, three matches <coughs> I got injury, mm-hmm. and I can play last uh, three matches. And I think if I play that match, maybe I can score more. Okay. So uh, how was your rapport? How was the share? How was sharing dressing room like with Matarazi? Yeah, it's always good, uh, good to share with the uh, experienced player, like big player like Ilano, Mandy, and like Marco Materazzi. You know, it's good, like Mikel Silvestri in the first year. Mm. 
Um, it's always good to play with them. You know, we are lucky. Uh, and uh, just only not to play with them. We need to learn something from them. And I learn a lot from them. And I think we are lucky to get an opportunity to a big opportunity like that. Mm-hmm. Now, sticking to ISL, last season, uh, you donated your Man of the Match award uh, money to your village, people in village. Uh, so, how, how has things changed? Do you want to construct it was something in the village? Yeah, you know, whenever I help uh, some people, you know, uh, then I want to do like more, more, more and more every year. So, it helped me a lot, you know, uh, whenever I help some people, I'm happy and uh, it's good, it's good feeling to be. Uh, I'm a Christian and you know I want to help other people and I so I hope I'll do more like this so how does it feel when you go back to your village you know? yeah always good to go back in the hometown and stay, in the fa- stay with the family and friends and you know uh, especially Mizoram I miss it I miss so much mm-hmm. so now coming back uh, talking about Azol's run this yeah. time how does it feel because you are from the same some from the same town and mm-hmm. you are on the opponent's team. So when you play them and now you're seeing them, you know, almost the yeah. top in the race for the title. How does that feel? Yeah, it's always good to see as well as see back back in the I League and uh, this year they did so well, you know. But I mean the other team and I want to win the league so <laughs> <laughs> cannot say like that. But <clears throat> it's good. It's good to see that they're doing well. Mm. Uh, what is what is the everyday daily motivation that you have? Like the drive to play or be better at everything? Yeah, every day I need to be better. So that's why I, I feel every day and I wake up and I need to think what I need to do to improve my, my football. And every day I need to work uh, what uh, I need to do. And I think that's important. Okay. Uh, how is your relation with Head coach Sanjay so he's good coach, and you know, last three years uh, we know each other very well, and he's a nice person. And uh, we need to, you need to chat uh, like when you play ISL, he send some messages and good wishes, and you know, he's a very nice guy, and I like him, and he helped me a lot to get my confidence back, and, and uh, he get he gave me a lot of good opportunity. Okay, so uh, do you see yourself? Going back to your town, playing for one of the clubs there, or would you be a legend at Mohan I don't know. Football is different, you know. It's not like a job, so anything can happen. And uh, maybe next year we don't know. We don't know. We can Mohan Bagan play or not in the ISL. So let's see. Uh, but I, I cannot say right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, There's something more about how Bagan has been an instrumental in your, you know, career. Yeah, of course, Mohan Bagan is very important for me to change my football career, you know. When 2012, uh, when I played for Palaneros uh, in the high league, I I, I scored 12 goals, uh, Indian highest goal scorer. And that year, I got a call from national team. And I scored, I think, eight goals that, that season in the national team also. And uh, after that, I got injury. When I back to Pune, I got injury. Knee injury and I'm almost... One month, one year out, and so after that, I joined Dempo, and I think we not win the trophy, and uh, I think we are uh, finishing the top five in Dempo. So I went to Mahun Bagan. In the first year, we win the I League, and the next year, uh, Federation Cup, and you know, you did so well, and I got all my trophy in Mahun Bagan. You know, I get my confidence back, and uh, from Mahun Bagan, I loaned to Chennai, and we did qualify for the uh, knockout stays. And for the next ISL, win the trophy. I think Mohun Bagan is very important for me as officials, fans, you know. They support that they like anything. Whenever you go, like China, everywhere you go, you know, the most important thing is the fans. Without them, we cannot go alone. So, the most important thing is the fans. Mm. So, coming back to that, you know, fans, how is that? How Because we know fans in Kolkata can be aggressive as yeah, well. You know, they they take course. things seriously. So, you know. They may, they may also cast their own player for missing out yeah. on something. You were one of the victims mm-hmm. when you missed the penalty shot. Yeah. Does, does that does that still bother you when you always whenever you take penalty next time? No, uh, you see, it's football. You know, sometimes last 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 match you can see him Ibrahimovic. He missed penalty. He's top player. He's the best striker. You know, sometimes you can miss, but uh, every, every time you score, every day every day every time you cannot score goal. So. This football and but some pe- some fans are they want they want to win they want to score more goal for me from my side and I understand uh, what they 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 thinking 
But like I said, this is football, and you need to win. You need to. You need sometimes you lose, sometimes you win, and but fans want the trophy, and every day they want to win, especially Calcutta fans. So we need to do well, and I hope we need to give something back for them. So any player or team that you look up to in the international circuit, anything? No, it's not. Right now, it's not. No. <laughs> so, any any message for the Mohan Bagan fans? Yeah, like Mohan Bagan's fans are always fantastic. You know, we are. I would like to thank them, and we, we need uh, the support more, more and more and more support from them. So, I hope we'll bring back the I League and uh, that is something. Mm. Well, so, to end, uh, what about the national team? How has that been? Your relations with Steve Mohan since Yeah, like I said. Uh, Right now, I'm achieving everything. Is uh, it depend on the three coaches like Stephen Constance, Sanjeshan, and Marco Materazzi. Materazzi, you know, the, the three of them are uh, believing me and they giving me a good opportunity. And uh, when Stephen Constance is coming to the national team, before before he come, maybe I'm out, in, out, in. You know, that time most of them probably my knee injury. So when Constance is coming and then he believing me and he giving me a good opportunity and you know. Uh, very important for me. Mm. He's a nice person and he'll, he helping me a lot to get my confidence. Mm. So when so now when you joined by the national team, your main motive would be playing Cambodia and Myanmar, right? Yeah. And you would want to. Yeah, start. of course. Uh, you need to win these two matches because if we, this Cambodia is the friendly match, but if yeah. you win that match and we can uh, gain a uh, FIFA ranking and you know ranking is right now important for for, for us and especially to. Preparation for the Asian Cup qualifier. I think if we can do well in the Cambodia match, maybe we can continue with uh, Myanmar also. But not easy match. Uh, Myanmar have a good side and uh, we cannot take easy. But I hope we can do well. So there it is. Good days for TFG. First we had Sunil Chetri. Now we had JJ. Uh, it, it's it's a privilege for an organization like sporting organization like us to you know have uh, all the sporting personalities come and talk to us. Uh, you can read more about JJ Sunil Chetri on our website thefangarage.com. You can connect us via Twitter TFG Football as well as via Facebook The Fan Garage. You can listen to our podcast on Indusbox Media, Audible, SoundCloud, iTunes, and definitely on YouTube. Subscribe, share, like, and comment, and do. Download this app IBM Podcast on Android and iOS. Till then, take care. Hey man, just help me out, man. I need some. I need some podcast, man. I haven't had a fix in a week. Just need some. Don't you worry about it. I got podcast galore for you, man. Just go to ivmpodcast.com. You can also find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Thanks, man. I'm gonna check it out.